Okay, so for those of you that have heard, Lexi has a project, my little sister, to build a catapult. Um, she just left for school, so she's not here, but I wanted to make a video just to show off our catapult. Um, it's made of mostly wood. I think the rules are it has to be made out of wood, the frame and the arm. So you see the frame here has the springs connected to it. We put two eyelets to um, strengthen the power if we have to. The objective is to hit 25 feet. So we got two springs going up to the top, a laundry detergent cap to hold the golf ball. Um, we put a little extra twist on it because I like to do things like that. And see here is the remaining parts of a remote control car. Uh, we went to the store and I brought the idea up to Alexis on automatically shooting it with a remote. So I explained motors to her and mechanics. Uh, we have a remote control now, leftover parts and pieces of a remote control car, things we don't need. Uh, if I, let me roll it out here. This is the, the complete catapult. So if I flip it, flip it over on the bottom, you'll see, this is the bottom section of the remote control car. We screwed into the bottom here um, with a the battery. The wire goes this way. That's underneath. The wire travels here around the side to, which used to be the rear of the remote control car. Uh, we took the tire off. We attach the wheel to a string, to a latch. So when you pull this down, you can latch it there. I could not latch that with uh, holding the camera, but uh, she pulls it back, she latches it, and then you see we should have the string here connected to the wheel, which used to be a remote control car, to the motor, which is wired up to the battery pack in the front to power it. See, we have the antenna sticking out the top. So this is the catapult locked and loaded. Well, not loaded. I guess I have the golf ball, but uh, ready to go. You got the two springs. We are on the first setting. We did put out a measuring tape down the edge of the driveway and to the end of the driveway is 25 feet. She's supposed to hit a target at 25 feet. It seems like on the first set of loops, we're hitting 25 feet pretty good, but if we want to have some fun, we'll put it to the second loop, which gives it some more power. Um, Lexi learned all about mechanics springs, power, uh, wiring. She also greased up uh, the, the pivot point here. Um, it was a good time and a good project. And I, I, I think I'm gonna go to the school with her when they shoot them to see how it goes, but um, the, the arm is on. So she can step back with her remote and once she um, I guess you would say drives the car forward the sucker will shoot end of the driveway is exactly 25 feet so yeah if this thing doesn't get an A if we don't get an A I mean, not only is it efficient, does it automatically shoot with a remote control, um, it, it hits 25 feet on the mark. So 